Hey guys, what's up? No Rage here. So there's this new trick that a lot of people have been using to uh, get better frame rates in Marvel Heroes. And it's simply to enable the 64-bit version of Marvel Heroes through Steam. If you're a Steam user, then you can use this trick, and it might help you get a little bit better frame rate in Marvel Heroes. Uh, one thing... If you enable this, know that the 64-bit version is a beta version of the Marvel Heroes client. You may encounter some bugs or even crashes, so enable this at your own risk. Alright, so to do this, what you're going to want to do is right-click on your desktop and go to New Shortcut. You're going to create a new shortcut, and in this, it's going to ask you for a path. The path you want, I'll include in the description below. But here it is. It, uh, it's basically your Steam Apps folder. Common, Marvel Heroes, Unreal Engine, si Win64. This is the important part that differs from the 32-bit client. You want to be on Win64, Marvel Heroes. Like I said, I'll include this in the description below. Um, but if you are like me and you've installed Marvel Heroes on another drive that's not your C drive, your C drive is your main drive, but if you've installed it somewhere else, then you'll need to adjust the path accordingly. And I've installed mine on my external hard drive, my, my book that I got a while back. So I am instead in the path G, Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Marvel Heroes, blah, blah, blah. So anyway, let's create this command. Let's name it, uh, we'll just call it Marvel Heroes 2015. And I think I've got an extra shortcut, so I'm just going to add uh, 2 here. And finish. Now you're all done. You can use this shortcut to launch Marvel Heroes in the 64-bit version. And hopefully get some better frame rates while doing it. Alright guys, that's it. Enjoy. And until the next video, take it easy, have a good one, peace.